Thank you, Kendrick. And thank you, Drake. Drake. For arguably the most exciting two weeks in hip hop for the last like 20 <laughs> years. Bro. Did, you see, did you see that like, comment of uh, we are so invested in this beef? I've not seen any on that year. You're Kendrick, bro. <laughs> <laughs> The guy has taken too much. <laughs> what happened to Mr. Maidy? Uh, what's your convict music guy? You're not just a Nigerian guy. Convict music. Was that actually? Mr. First of all, Maidy. you're the type of me one that stays yeah. on my mind. I thought he was like saying to like, what's the name of the other guy? Uh, like Diband or something. Actually, it might have. I think they said convict music because of Echo and that. Yeah, because yeah. I, was, I was confused. <laughs> but they said after Mr. Maidy. Yeah. Exactly. Now Echo. <laughs> No, what it's Akon first. Akon, P square, yeah, then Mr. Maidy. Yeah, mm. Hey, bro, Mr. Maidy. Okay, one thing about Afrobeats is that guys come just as fast as uh, they go just as fast as they come. What's so the you have to give it to guys who's last. Who had the whining waist song? Whining who waist song. Yanya. Oh, I got some bobs. Oh, that guy loved his body. That guy body, also bro. dipped, bro. Every song he'd find out to remove himself, like his promise shut. Is this Mr. Flavor also singing? Hey, am I confusing Yanya with Mr. Flavor? Because both of them said he loved his waist. I was thinking Mr. Flavor. Mm. Mr. Flavor had one jam. No way. Yanya no. had no bops. way. Relax, no. relax. Mr. Which, Mr. which other jam? Bops. Which other one? Okay, let me just go down. First Mr. check. Mr. First you know what's funny? Snap. I read that he's the also snapper. one of the richest artists in Nigeria. Mr. Flavor. It's mm-hmm. possible, man. <laughs> it's possible. No, no, maybe he owned all his distribution rights. Let me tell you, the number of artists who are not big names but have money. It's crazy, bro. Bro, Mr. Mr. Maidy is signed to Davido, bro. Hey, is it? May actually don't even have a song that came out recently. Ah no, I think it's thirty nine years. No, 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 no. They have a song. <laughs> that's have a that's song. a shocking <laughs> part, bro. Wait, how old is Odumodu? Is it Odumodu in his thirties also? I think it's like thirty one. No, bro. Mm. Maidy Davido. I was here, Mr. Flavor Bobs, man. But also, all, they're not uh, low, low. Not like you know, low, low, low. Releasing bangers may kind of feel that like Mr. Flavor. they are not releasing maybe. anymore. Yeah. Remix. Go, you guys. I, don't I, don't. I feel like maybe sometimes when they're not releasing any bangers, it kind of feels like they're not releasing. Come again? When they're not putting out bangers, yeah. it feels like they're not, not releasing music. <laughs> they're not, they're not who? Like those artists, artists like the one you're talking about right now. Because maybe. Eh? Yeah. Sometimes you think that maybe the guy fell off or something. This guy's name is not Mr. Flavor, bro. It's just Flavor. Flavor mm. Nabania. That's the name. Oh. How many monthly listeners? Almost a million. Almost a mil. Big Bowler, Powers, DK, IK. I don't even know these jams that are his top five, bro. Yeah, but those are, those are like... Know why. Those are just what you call Only them. one. Topics. Like, yeah. But you, see, you, you check the streams on those things. Those songs you don't even know. The, the top five. You go to This Is Flavor. That's why you see that... It's still the same top five gems. Fair play, fair play. But first, go and we check the streams of these songs we don't even know. Is it M's on all of them? Let me see. M's, the top M's, is yeah, M's, five, M's. seven, fourteen M for Noah Baby. What's Noah Baby? Is that a Noah, Noah Baby? Mm, Bam mm, to mm, me, mm. Noah mm. Baby. That's the one I know. Is that bro. Asha? Asha? That's Asha, fourteen, Asha, Asha, that's 14 Asha, on Spotify. Oh, but oh. Spotify was out when that song was popped. Yeah, had like two billion. <laughs> 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 that was that song was everywhere. That bro. song. <laughs> It is it that, like the song which like spearheaded the entire Nigerian music stuff in Yoji? No, no that's P Square. That's that that has to be P Square. I said P Square and Two Face. Two Face. To me, yeah. if you had, if you ask me, but I'm sure there are older people who maybe remember some older guy, mm. but for me, it's those two. Those guys are responsible for like toppling the Congolese regime. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> those guys took took over, bro. Alright, uh, welcome back to the Mob Jazz Podcast. We'll be back, we'll be back. Um, this is a bro pod, this is a bro pod. Yep. We realize you guys like babes, man. Man, From stop Every it. time there's a chick on the thumb, mm. guys want to go tap on the pod <laughs> to watch it. What up with you guys? What up with you guys, man? And guys what be having feedback. I'm actually <laughs> calling you. Actually, you should have started with this. I'm <laughs> calling you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you yeah. might not reach here because there's no babe on the thumb. very strange. <laughs> we don't like it. We don't like it's it. It's very man. strange. I know that apparently our audience is like majority male. And I imagine that means straight male. My <laughs> guys need to chill, bro. <laughs> <laughs> guys it's not that deep. Speaking of, we bench. should have a month. A month where I just have homies, bro. Mm. Get, <laughs> we won't get no views, bro. Just the water. Guys, when I was coming, I bought a bo- I bought a border, and this chick guy was looking at every chick. 
Yeah, you know, like, judge guy. Yeah, he, his face would follow a thing. Like, each time he would pass any chick. I was like, bro, yeah, you're, are you you're from prison? I'm going to die of thirst, bro. Yeah, I'm going to from another man's thirst, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's so crazy. That's bro. funny. That's so crazy. I wonder what it's like to be a border guy. Not in that way, but like, you know, riding a bike, you can. But riding a bike with another guy on it, is there like a different you guys type of physics to it? So yeah, of course it must be like difficult. On a bo- my, my, a motorbike? Sorry, a bicycle? Yeah, but you still like require you feel like the, you know, balance. The yeah, there's, 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 cause man, you know me when I'm right, when I'm on a bike, you kind of have to move with that guy, cause like if he turns on you, you stay straight. It's like relax. You guys feel like that guy. Uh, <laughs> that, uh, that's how you fall down. <laughs> you guys feel like it's it's harder to ride a border in Kampala than it is to drive a car. Cause when you're driving a car. What makes it difficult in Kampala? Yes, the other drivers are aggressive, but border guys, bro, having to watch for border guys. So now what about the border guys? I guess... No, I think it's simpler for them. I yeah. think with experience, yeah. not a new guy. I mean, that was a new guy. Uh, wait, a new yeah. border rider. Right it's easier to drive a car in Kampala. I think it's easier to drive a car. It's easier to drive a car in Kampala than a border. border. That's, that's what, what I think. Me, I, believe, I believe that's what I think it is as well. Because mm. Mm. when you're watching out for borders inside the car, Mm. What you really mean is you don't want this guy to scratch you or break your light or that's what you mean. <laughs> but when a boy that guy <laughs> says he's watching out for cars, it means like his whole leg is going or he's going to his life. I you think know, it's, it's like tougher a life for a new, ga- a new border guy, bro. Because mm. mm. first of all, you're new to the border. A car, you don't need to learn more balance. And even mm. if you knock, mm. man, you're, you're kawa inside the car. knocked my body of the car. Hey. You haven't knocked your body. Knocked my body. Bro, a border. On a car. <laughs> 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 a car has knocked my body. border guy. You're a fighting border. cars and border guys. And balance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And border guys have no patience for new border. Exactly. exactly. Yeah. And you have to like, if you're in traffic, you have to maneuver. Yeah. So you have to like step down. That's a new feeling. And, and literally like borders uh uh, on two wheels, so that means they are only balanced when they are moving. Mm-hmm. So stop, once it stops, yeah. you are no longer balanced. Until now, there's so that, that means where if you are knocked, you're moving because you know this you're already off balance. It comes with experience. It's like you're in a car when you see a pothole, you pass it in between the two tires. Mm-hmm. No, judge guy, you see it coming. You're like, <laughs> do you do you swerve? <laughs> and like those guys on M- Moto GPX, <laughs> and you like touch the ground and try to ah, solve the border. <laughs> nah, nah, that. <laughs> That's just how it works. You have bro. to ask you yourself first of all, do I enter the road or outside? But I'll say this: a border handles potholes better than a car. Definitely does. Yeah, way better. Definitely does. Yeah, but I'll tell you this: no, that's why in the a number l- of times I've been on a border moving behind a car. Yeah. Mm. My so this in and the car pass the portal is in between the car and as we are just entering it, bro. Mm-mm. I'll tell you, it depends on the it depends on the portal first of all. If that portal mm-hmm. is what terrible for a boat, eh? fast yeah, he needs to know. If that portal if that portal is terrible for a boat, eh? I don't know what it does to cars, bro. Like, but see, like we said before, can put it between it to the I, car. I, I, yeah, mm. I think it's very dependent, bro. Guys down. Yeah. <laughs> you can hit a portal and sit on your balls, bro. <laughs> I hit a on a border when Rumble you strips. <laughs> have, you ever a, have you ever hit a portal with a border guy by surprise? Mm. Oh my god. Yeah. Your, your stomach is feeling like like your spine. Oh. That shit hurts like hell. Especially if you, you can feel like a metal gap between, between oh. like your you know, metal part on the back. That sh- that's yeah. why yeah. I hold that thing because <laughs> I have to make sure that <laughs> my I'm not sitting on it, bro. Yeah, because if you hit bro, a your, pothole, bro, your tailbone, g- that thing you can literally squeeze your eyes at that <laughs> border, bro. <laughs> yeah. it, <I> just, <laughs> anyway. What's this thing called again? Stana, solar plexus. Solar plexus, you can feel it open. Okay, like, There's a gap. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, elephant in the room. Now that this beef is done, it's not done. Yeah, it's gone quick. It's okay, done. Okay, hold on. It's done. We don't know. We, we don't know if it's done. Yeah. Can you guys respond it? So this guy's going to drop a second jam. Yet. Okay, let's get into it. Let's get into it. Uh, actually, we'll actually let's, let's start with a round of applause to Melvo, who predicted the hard part six. Part six. Yeah. As expected. Yeah. Now, put uh, in digital. Guys were DMing DM me. Put in the applause digital. Yeah. <laughs> First ask, wait, Melvin, when is my wedding? Let me tell you, when I saw that Greek song, the hard part six, I had not yet listened to and time stamped that pod. As soon as I asked, like, let me do this shit now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so that this pod can come out now. So yeah. that that just didn't seem like we had it after the hard part six. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Um. Yeah, man. Where do we start? The last time we were here, it was Euphoria, and six sixteen. We should have never titled that pod the hard part six. 
that one. Eh? <laughs> 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 I really thought about it. Man. I really thought about it. You guys will think we're psychic on this uh, peak. Yeah, but Euphoria and 616 are just dropped. Not Euphoria and 616. I just dropped. Yeah. Yeah. Cuz there's a back to back to back drop. Yeah. yeah. But had they dropped Family Matters yet? No. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah, they they dropped Family yet. Um so maybe let's start with Family Matters. No, nah, I don't go in by a chronological order. I want hey. now like uh Hindsight, yeah, yeah. hindsight. Yeah. Let's, let's do, let's like do highlight. Like it makes Post okay. game analysis. Okay, okay. Post game analysis. Who do we start with? Do, should we go one for one? Let's just do thoughts. Thoughts, because okay, a lot has happened since six okay. sixteen oh. and euphoria. Okay, you start, because I don't know what thoughts do you want to do first. <laughs> now, oh, by the way, as we say one. all these things, there was a shooting around Drake's house today morning. Really? Yeah. In Canada, literally like thirty minutes back. A shooting in around Canada at his home. No, 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 no. The one, the one in the US. Yeah, hey, Calabas was on the Kendrick's no, thing. That was the Canada thingy. one. That, that was the Canada the, house. That the yeah, that was Bridal Path. Whichever. The embassy. The, the there was a shooting around this. Yeah, but the name was called Bridal Path. There was a shooting okay. around this script today morning, man. Okay. Yeah. Let me just give my general, what the general synopsis mm. of what has happened so far. Uh, <laughs> Kendrick has put out four songs. Drake has put out four songs. This is what I see for me. First of all, I think that they've both put out four really good songs. That's mm-hmm. the first thing I need to say. They've both played to their strengths, like Magic said last time, and put out Drake-esque and Kendrick-esque these songs. Kendrick's four have been... I can just tell that from those two weeks or whatever that Drake was baiting him, Kendrick was making those songs. Kendrick, I don't think left oh, the studio. Oh, he was thinking at the very least. I think Kendrick brought a mattress to the studio <laughs> and laid it out, had a writing camp with the guys, and they cooked up those four songs and knew how they were going to drop them and drop them in that order, bro. Exactly how they wanted to. So I'll say that. I'll say Kendrick was extremely, like Kendrick's strategy worked. Also, I need to say, I think that, that Kendrick's have a lot of bloggers on their side, bro. I think the blogs are on the Kendrick's end, <coughs> and it's helping to sway the public's opinion, bro. The blogs are reposting Kendrick shit constantly. I don't know if it's just my algo, bro. Maybe you guys can tell me. <coughs> but the blogs are reposting him so crazy. The algorithm is in his favor, because as soon as you play any of the Drake Day songs, Euphoria is playing after it. Whether it's on whether it's on Spotify, whether it's on YouTube, whether it's on on Apple Music, particularly Euphoria, bro. Is if it? you play I can if you play any of the this songs in this battle, just know Euphoria is coming bro. next. Our algos are different. Yeah. But it's called you okay, game. Let me let me learn. Game. Yeah. Let me learn. That's what for me, that's how it has been. Mm. Um so I'll say that about the Kendrick shit. I, I think he dropped he has dropped brilliantly, bro. Like he didn't give Drake a moment to breathe after Family Matters dropped. So he kind of like stepped on a lot of the family matters like jazz with Mita Grams. Um, hmm. I really want us to read like song for song, but maybe we'll do that after you guys have given your general synopsis. <coughs> but I think that, now for Drake's four. I think Drake had all of that momentum in the beginning. Oh, he at least took some of the momentum from like that. I think Drake suffered from not putting push-ups out immediately, like, correctly, I feel like. Because push-ups first dropped with a different beat. Then it kind of, like, lingered for a while, him refusing to put it out. Then he finally put it out with the beat, but guys had already kind of had all the lyrics, so it wasn't slapping the same. So I think that push-up, a lot of guys kind of just, like, breezed over push-ups. So he doubled down with Taylor Made. Taylor Made everyone acknowledged. But he couldn't put it out anywhere. So Taylor Made could never come out. Then Taylor Made got even removed from his IG. So guys can't even go there for it. And then Kendrick came with Euphoria. So like, I think that that, that first round, tough for Drake. The last two songs Drake put out. <laughs> I loved both of them. Family Matters. I had it the same way that I had Taylor Made. First thing in the morning, Sato Mona. First thing. I opened to, to timestamp the, the pod. 
I find family matters immediately click bro mm. that she was fire bro 7 minutes of pure heat what does a youtube algorithm do after that immediately euphoria first you euphoria with the grams <laughs> immediately <laughs> after bro me the grams please i'm like oh shit bro but me i love family matters cuz mm. still on drink love family matters um <coughs> yesterday he dropped uh the hard part 6 loved it spectacular song so i think that like if guys just look at the songs hey, i think hey, hey you have been addressed not like us you just rolled oh away oh my god <laughs> <laughs> What not like us dropped before <coughs> the hard part 6. Yeah, before before before. Drop before the hard yeah. part 6. This guy dropped bro dropped mid the grams, then dropped not like us like a few hours after it. He dropped three jams in two days, just yes. so you know. <laughs> Now not like us is the one it's different from all the other ones. Cuz as soon as I had that one. <laughs> <laughs> I said, "Oh shit, bro." That one day that's now like the club bop. Of everything that has been dropped The club bops like that it seems like Euphoria is going to be a club bop and not like us club bops and in addition to those three this guy has two introspective deep records bro <laughs> it's been a tough one for Drake I don't hope as a Drake fan and I'm you know I'm a fan of both of these guys but it's been a tough one for Drake versus the Drake ones where truly like I don't think there's any like You don't think there's anyone? I don't know if there's a club banger in any of the Drake ones. Yeah, Push Ups is a club banger. So is um Family Matters in a way. At least the first half DJs can play with it. Even the second part. It's not first. about can. I feel like if a DJ wants. For he me can that's play with any issue. of them, bro. It's, for me it's not a question of can. It's a question of will or are. I, it depends. And I don't know if it's just the blogs that are that are putting this in my face. But I've just been seeing videos of guys in clubs dancing to euphoria dancing to family matters i haven't seen a single video of guys dancing to any of the dis- drake this songs bro. Mm. do you mean not like us instead of family matters sorry no not like us yeah not yes. like us okay guys going crazy going word for word bro like guys have now made it a set like that into euphoria into family matters bro anyway those are my thoughts on the beef so far man i think that they both did a good job i think that Wait, not euphoria in two family matters and two like that. Nah, like that. Like that first. Into euphoria, into family matters. You end on an introspection. <laughs> um not into family matters. Sorry, into, into not like not us. Not like us. Yeah. But uh yeah man, I think they both did their best, but I think that Kendrick has edged it, bro. Like I just think that his strategy was too His strategy first of all, I told you guys everyone wants streak to lose, bro. So that was the first thing. But I think that Kendrick's strategy was just too smart, bro. He basically at some point he was dropping two songs for every one song that Drake put out that has had a real effect on the fucking beef, bro. Real effect. Cuz before guys can even deep that Drake shit, this guy has put out two songs for guys to think about, bro. Anyway, what do you guys think? Should I go next or you want to go? Next? He wants to go last. Last. Day. Yeah. All right, cool. So now me because the playoffs are happening. I'm awake, bro. Mm. I'm working. <laughs> I'm watching basketball. I'm seeing you on the group 4 and seeing the live. Like you be bashing. Like you be the bashing. You be bashing as we are baby. Uh, so I listened to every jam literally like 15 minutes after it has dropped from when we last discussed. So family matters. I'll say this. Um fire song. And please not everything I say I'm a fan of both. I still love both. Fire song. My only qualm with it was this guy was addressing mob guys, bro. Addressing he was addressing mob addressing guys. Everybody. Well, Kendrick was like, "Me, I want you. You're one mm, guy. You're the one I want." TV one. Yeah, and I get, but again, us the beef is one v one, bro. This guy is addressing mob guys. So because of that, I think first listen, aside from the middle section. The rest of it was almost rumble to me because it was directed to other guys. I'm like I don't I don't want to listen to throws at Asa Proki man. Like relax. We want this guy. This is who we want. That shit was funny though. Bro. Yeah, it was. It was, was. It was. It was. It was. <laughs> <laughs> But I'll say this. 
fire song. So it has just been released. I'm watching the game. And this song plays at halftime. The Drake song? Mm-hmm. On TNT. Not even in the stadium. Uh, On TNT. I'm like, game? guys. Um, I think it was the... Was it game seven? Of? Uh, Cubs Magic. No, no, it wasn't game seven. It was a game before, so it must have been the last Knicks game. Mm. And I've listened to the song. I'm like, hey, fire, 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 fire. Immediately, I'm just seeing Kendrick has dropped. Like, bro, how is it so quick? And here's the thing. Uh, I remember the last pod we were talking about, like, types of these tracks, you know, the ones you gave us. I want guys to say horrific things, bro. Like, I'm not here for the song. Mm. Okay, I am. But, like, I also want to listen to the bars. That song was not nice, bro. Mm. Which one? The Meet the Grams? Yeah. It was not nice. Like, it was me. That song was, it was dark, bro. Like, I was listening to it, like, relax. It was very like Adam's family. Yeah. <laughs> the beat was really like, like <laughs> and, and this, yeah. this is the thing I appreciated about that song. Kendrick knows how to make music in that even the song itself, the beat, the way he was talking, everything makes you feel like, bro, chill. Chill. This, this is not a song for you to play around with. This is, this is, this is a visceral song. So, I'm like, eh, bro, it's a tough one for Drake. And <laughs> it's, it's rap beef, so I know everyone is on like, is this true, is it not? I don't care, personally. This is rap beef. Guys have been capping in rap beef <laughs> since the, the 90s, so it's cool. Um, then this guy releases Not Like Us. Now, I listen to that jam. But it's a bop mm-hmm. from the start. It's a bop. I'm like, this is a club banger. Currently, that song is at 6.9 million streams. It has displaced... 6.9? Yeah. Not at like 20 a.m. Bro, is, I don't know. It was 6.9 over for the f- over for per day, over for the first day. It has displaced another Drake jam. Girls like girls. I'm like, bro, either this is, um, as you said, maybe the bloggers, blah, 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 or people actually love this jam. Mm. But I'll say this. My algorithm is very... This is, this is not on YouTube. This is on uh, Spotify streaming, by the way. Um, my algorithm is very balanced. Okay. Very, very balanced. Because, okay. you know, there are guys who really... They're like, Kendrick is lying, what, 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 what. The guys were like, nah, Kendrick's things were fire. Like, it's really balanced. Um, 42? So 22, eh? Not like us. Literally that same night, I'm watching the game. No, this is last night. Or the, other, or the night before. They play not like us at halftime, bro. TNT was just like, us, we are going to play every jam they release. <laughs> Which game was this? This was last night, I think. But what uh, game, no, what teams were playing? Uh, this is Pacers Knicks, I think. Pacers, no, 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 Nuggets. Nuggets uh, yeah, Nuggets Wolves. They play it at half time. Those like on the west coast of America. Um, Denver Nuggets Denver versus Nuggets, the I mean, New York th- Knicks. Those are west no, coast no, no, semi finals. No, no, no. So yeah. yeah, Nuggets, Nuggets. What what are the Timber, Timberwolves? Denver, Denver Colorado. No, okay, what? No, not no. Okay. Minnesota. No, Minis- Minnesota. Yeah, Minnesota Knicks. Minnesota. Yeah. So okay, that's a West Coast jam. That makes sense. Yeah, there's West Coast teams. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, and then Drake releases... The Hard Part 6. Yeah, The Hard Part 6. <coughs> Fire jam. I didn't like one thing about it. It was... He was on the defensive, man. Mm. It, it was literally like, ah, you say this jazz, I baited you. And the rest is like, man, I didn't do it. Did you see guys posting those things of source? Wallahi, trust me, bro. I can't do any research. Did you see, did you see, at, uh, Drake's, Drake's reasoning is, if I'm lying, then why aren't my pants on fire? <laughs> 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 yeah. If I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I just, I, I, I really like listening to Drake on the offensive. Mm. From, the bu- from the beginning, he was mm. so... Him being on the defensive was kind of a big switch for it was me. New, yeah. yeah, I was like, yeah. Hmm, I don't like. I like the song. I don't like this though. Okay. Like I, yeah. I need some heat from you also. Yeah. So in my opinion, again, Kendrick has just edged it. He has just edged it. Uh, whether it's cap or not, me, I don't mind, because everyone is going to say, ah, this is cap. Blah 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 blah. blah. Fire as cap. Bro, that cup was fire. It was fire. We lied, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
And then, of course, as you said, bloggers, guys have found articles from exactly 11 years ago, blah, blah, blah. People are getting proof. Others are getting proof about the pedophilia accusations. Um, Yo, like, wait. Others are getting proof on Kendrick. Bro. Like, it's just the battle on the streets is worse than the, <laughs> the actual so the, beef, bro. So, the blogs are trying to fact check the words or the buzz. Mm, yeah. mm, mm. Everyone is, bro. Jazz. Everyone is. Everyone yeah, is. Like doing deep dives. Like you see, guys <laughs> saying that right now this thing is even till a guy has proof. Yeah. Whoever has proof wins. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I'll say this it has also cooking. been very different from a lot of rap battles in the past because this one is more like tea. Do you feel like this, like this, this is what I have on this guy? Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. Whereas back in the day, bro, that's what just abusing but themselves. But also you see, bro. like, that's what battle rap is like. Exactly. The guys will be battle rapping as in the guys, well, there's no beat. The guy just, the guy will just come up with some jazz <laughs> about you that actually <laughs> happened, bro. <laughs> Some just about your dad, or sometime when they coach you on the beach, like that's what it is. Exactly. Like guys be investigating and each other before they come for the battle, bro. That's exactly what Jazzy has been. Yeah. Now my issue is, why are guys finding fault with that? No, now in hip hop, it hasn't. I don't think it has. It has been like that for a while. Like in hip hop, it has kind of been. I hate you, so I'll diss you, diss you, diss you, threaten violence, threaten violence, mm. threaten violence. Mm. But ever since the Drake and Pusha T shit, they're now going to like proper battle rap rules. I just have tea on you. I'm bro. going to. What do you call it? I'm going to drag your name through the mud. I saw, I saw someone saying that thing and I was like, this doesn't make sense to me, man. Because this is how I've known battle rap, but rap since I started I seeing battle rap. Like, when Park was one. saying, I fucked your wife. <laughs> we, we don't know. Mm. And the guy has passed. There's nothing we can do to fact check it. But yeah, anyway, um, in my opinion, Kendrick has aged it. Um, but again, this is Drake. You never know what he can come up with. Then again, this is Kendrick. The guy might have four jumps seated. Yeah. <laughs> waiting, bro. But I'll say this. The funniest beat was Metro, man. Yeah. Metro. Leyla and Wayne. <laughs> yeah. Metro and Rick Ross have made it so entertaining. Oh, my god! Because, bro, Ricky the Rosie. songs those guys have made on that car beat. Eh? BBL Drizzy. BBL Drizzy. Yes, bro, did you see the BBL guy getting... Uh, there was a thread of him... <laughs> Getting this in all languages. Japanese, Spanish, French, Italian. BBL, Drizzy. <laughs> I haven't had a single one of those songs. I'm not sure, bro. BBL, Drizzy, but that, that, it's cringe, bro. Um, yeah, but yeah, that's my opinion. Uh, Magic, what do you think? Bro, so now for me... General my synopsis. General synopsis is... Mine is a bit philosophical. It gets into, like, what is hip-hop, what is not. Like, Come on. type levels. Mm. I need to preface this by saying... Since we left, I haven't listened to any other songs other than this diss track. <laughs> this, this is the first music that has taken me out of my album. Bro, I won't lie. I played like an Afrobeat song yesterday and it didn't sound the same, bro. bro this song <laughs> put me in a different mood, like angry. This guy's trying to call me today, but I was picking up the phone pissed because I was pissed that he was interrupting the jams. <laughs> like, then I agree, Shan has pissed. You know, where am I pissed? And I was been listening to Euphoria. And yeah, like and yeah, yeah, they yeah, not yeah. like us all day. Yeah. No, 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 no. And then cleanse, bro. Thank bro, you. I saw, I saw your tweet of cleanse. Listening, <laughs> listening <laughs> to terms to cleanse. It was real, like bro. But anyway, besides the point, let's go back. But before you go, bro, I want to know you have been like between these these songs. I've been listening to Party Next Door. <laughs> I've been listening to terms. <laughs> I like, love Mark on it. Yeah. <laughs> for the, the most beautiful R and B has been dropping in this period when these guys have been putting out these yeah. eight songs. Man. I just keep. And you go Unfortunately, ahead, I'm, I'm I'm on the same vibes as Magic yeah, Man. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. um, you guys say that Drake baited, or at least Melvin said, but I honestly believe it was Kendrick that baited Drake. I think Kendrick has hated this guy for a long time. He had a bar, I think, in Euphoria, where like when they, I, I I I aimed my Drake at him, but I didn't aim low enough. So this time, I won't make. I've learned yeah, from those mistakes. Yeah. 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 You know. And now, when I listen to the algorithm after this played, um, I think it's All all My Stars by Cesar and Kendrick. Mm-hmm. But if you listen to that song, bro, that, those, that Kendrick verse could have easily fit Drake. in oh. this rap beef, any of those rap beef songs. Every, every Kendrick song right now it sounds, sounds like, like that. Drake. Thank you. Because I've been bathing in Kendrick. Now, I went, of them. I went back and was listening to it. Now, after it, it played me humble. Now mm. I I listen to Humble from the perspective of imagine he was talking to this bro. It still <laughs> fits like he's saying the exact same stuff. Like, like okay, I'll give you like the Caesar example. He, in that song he said um, 
He said um, something like, I don't like people that's entitled, getting mm. angry because you weren't invited to the party. The guy's like, oh yeah, important. You're the moral you. to the story. Yeah. Motherfucker, I don't even like you. Who, who I, I don't even want your congratulations. Could easily, whatever. So I feel like this guy has been... What does that have to do with Black Panther? Let's relax. You actually... <laughs> If we, if, if we're going to bring that dimension <laughs> into the things, bro. <laughs> no, what I think it has to do eh, is it was after Dam. And Dam, now Dam, I think, was just for okay, Drake. But I think also just for context, this Kendrick has also been dissing Big Sean for a long time. Yeah, that's true. So a lot of those that's songs true. are about Big Sean and not about Drake. Fair enough, fair enough, yeah. fair enough. But Big Sean hasn't yet gotten an EP out of this guy dedicated <laughs> to him, bro. So I was listening to Humble. Bro, Humble, same thing. Then Loyalty. The idea of that of that song, I don't know what they're saying, but the idea, imagine if he's trying to, because t- like, the way he labeled um, Dam, eh, it's like each title is just like uh, one word, like loyalty, love, yeah. humble. <coughs> it's like he's trying to teach a lesson in each song. And if, if I, no, for me, my perspective, if he's teaching Drake, eh, loyalty would be where he brings his old friend who he, they broke up with, you know, they, they, they have a falling out with because... I just teach him about loyalty and did it with Rihanna. I don't know if that fits in, but like this was me now in the deep hole yeah, that I was in. You're doing the Cinderella oh. sisters thing, but you're forcing the shoe <laughs> into the <laughs> forcing the leg into the shoe. No, bro. I don't know what they're saying, loyalty. Like I said, but me, I'm just thinking. Imagine if that's what was going on. Mm. So, when I, I honestly believe, from what I've been hearing, like Kendrick's beef with Drake is number one he does not consider him a rapper or hip-hop at all and he hates the fact that drake is constantly trying to put himself in that conversation like top five top three and for him is like no you're like you're like beyonce or you're like lady gaga just make me dance and put my hands up and things will be all right that was a buy in euphoria just just make me raise my hands up and dance and things will be all right but I like Drake. I like Drake when he's with the melodies. I don't like Drake when he acts tough. You know, when he tries to be the hip hop and like. So I feel like this guy. First of all, I don't believe that he wrote those songs after like after like that. Uh, like that. No, I feel like he had Meet the Grahams. I feel like he had Euphoria, and I feel like he had the first two verses of like that. I I don't I can't say six sixteen so much because I've listened to it as the much first two since. verses of like that. Of not like not us. like us. Not like us. Yeah. Okay. Because that. The third one had the reference Wait, to them. Made, you think he made them before like that? Yeah. I think I think he made like that eh? to have another moment like control where he calls out everybody and the only guy who is pressed again who doesn't get that his friendly competition and not personal beef will be Drake. Yeah, but it's personal beef. I, I don't even put him as was it person Was it personal beef with um control? Control I don't even think was a this really it wasn't yeah but the only person who took it as a this was drake but this one was a this when he when he called out this big three now he, he had shortened it down from control and now look at it like control part two like his other voice is calling out the other top rappers now 10 years later who he considers his peers is it but you see what's no, i think no, i'm control going down my conspiracy I theory saying, but oh. i feel like saying i'm trying to make sure your core fans will act like they've never heard of you nigga it's so different from yo fuck the big three that's so different and there's just big me but i'll tell you this in like that he did not name drop a single person bro but no See, no no C- control he name dropped every single person not like, that, to. like uh, that came that's why i feel like that's why i feel like person shooter right mm. unless i'm bugging which one like that yeah and for me, the point I'm trying he to make is this: first person shooter yeah. in like that. Yeah. Me, the point I'm trying to make is this: <coughs> if he also is, he also said about I, I, I'm okay for all those nines. You go and see pets. But the issue is this: mm. he was baiting that guy. He was baiting either that guy or Jacob. Actually, both of them, because he wanted to prove once and for all that this. Okay, at least he doesn't consider Drake hip hop. Maybe Jacob, but also like completely dominate this Jacob guy. I think he wanted once and for all to draw like a line in the sand, like it's don't me, like I'm the, I'm the guy. I'm the guy. When you think of this generation of hip hop, it's me and then the other guys who are there when I was there. Not That's even that. It's it's deeper than that. It's like he's drawing a line. It's like this on this side of this line. This is hip hop. Everything else is like jabroni. 
uh, crowdy jazz, bro. Like this guy is not hip hop. So he had to, he he baited him into a hip hop beef where like everything is going to get all nasty, like how it was with Pusha T where he bowed out. But this time he can't bow out because it's Kendrick Lamar, imagine. But even if he bowed out, same effect. And this guy got outmaneuvered, bro. I know last time we stopped at um where were we? Euphoria 9616. He had just dropped um push ups, I think. And these are the response to push ups. This guy drops family matters, which I really like. But bro, when this man dropped Meet the Grahams, that's why for me my love of this beef I I I I fell off. I was like, I'm actually done. Like, this is too gross. Like, I don't need to know any of this. Like this guy is not talking to us, he's not trying to make a club banger, he's talking to one guy on this earth. Aubrey Graham, bro. And his mother and his father and his alleged daughter and his confirmed son. Like that's like that was so nasty, bro. But you know how crazy it is for them to talk to your son and say I'm your mentor now. Bro, they talk to him <laughs> last. <laughs> last. They talk to Aubrey last. But guys, that shit was so hard. <coughs> no, 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 I listened to that shit I was like, this is so hard. Like, it's exactly <laughs> like you said. Coming straight off that second bus of 616, bro. Mm. When he had just started to really go, that guy gets into that. I was like, oh my Meet God, the this ground. is so I, just like, I, I saw life. guys saying, Busimanya, it wasn't well mixed. Bro, what do you mean? I don't need that mix, bro. Bro. <laughs> I don't need that mix, bro. <laughs> that's that was enough, man. That thing was gr- That's when I realized that this, this is now, this is no longer cool. And, you know, there's this saying, Frederick Nietzsche said it, and this, is, I guess, is the most... One of the most clear examples of it. It says, well, take care when you fight against monsters that you don't become a monster yourself because those that stay into the abyss, it the abyss stares back at you. Yeah. Eh? So Kendrick has decided to go to those depths to attack this guy. But now I also look at Kendrick differently, kind man. Funny. I used to look at Kendrick as like the whole, the bigger, I'm higher really, road I'm guy. So he takes the higher road. No, no, I'm just telling you my so road, genuine bad. feelings on this thing. Mm-hmm. Like Kendrick was a guy who takes the higher road. In terms of like life and trauma, like you know, is bro, it? you are shitting on Jacob for taking the high road. No, bro. listen, I'm not saying about the high road of apologizing, bro. Yes. I'm talking but about that's the highest road, bro. <laughs> Nigga, that's not in, <laughs> not in <laughs> rap beef. That's the highest. He LL. wants a high road, not a flyover. Actually, that guy is now LL Col J. He reversed his name. See, no, that's the thing. I can't. You can't have the opinion that these guys have taken things too far and have waded in the mud and have like tarnished both of their reputations and then say that this guy was wrong for backing No, up I can no me can say all three have tarnished their reputations, man. How is Jacob tarnished his reputation? For being LL coach, you know the guy wa- waved his hand like this, man. Uh, if you think that Drake is the country is the number one rapper at Dreamville, bro. But this is my thing. About that J. Cole apology, bro, like every um, t- with every day song that has dropped, that thing has made the most sense in the anyway, world to me. You know, they say if you can't take the heat, come out for the kitchen. I guess he couldn't <laughs> take the heat. <laughs> he can't take the heat. No, like bro, he couldn't. He even knew himself. Just what was going to be required of him in this beef. You, we, no, you can, you can, you can, can you imagine extra if Jacob had entered this, had entered this beef and started rapping? Bro, you can make all the excuses you want for him. That guy bowed out already, man. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know, and it was the right like thing. Like long goes, bro. It was the right thing. But I will also do. tell you this regarding that. I expected this from Kendrick. Because anyway. Kendrick began as a battle rapper. This so was his game. Bro. So for me, for me, I'll say this. Me, I'll say this. Me, I'll say this. Me, I'll say this. He began as a battle rapper. He this. wasn't in I didn't know guy. that context. <laughs> but me, I, th- me, I thought from Mr. Moral, this man had reached like a different level of morality and spirituality. Mm. And he has. But now to see him weaponize that growth mm. in such a way. This man, like... His strategy was so much better than what you think about dropping after Drake. Like, his strategy was to paint a picture of Drake that is so vivid that you can't, you can't look away. This man was, I don't know, like, he, that his angle was like, okay, for me, it's what I think his angle was. His angle was, I want to expose Drake, that Drake is not a guy with a soul. He's not Kawa. He's weird. So I'm going to violate him in the worst way that I can on this track to another man that I can do to another man. Like, if I was violated, that would be Kendrick Lamar. But I'm going to walk on this earth until I find Kendrick Lamar and stab him. <laughs> like, I hear if you. ever. I hear you, I and hear I guess you. Kendrick wanted to show that Drake is the kind of guy who will hear this eh, and not be moved. And that will still prove his point. Like, this guy, like, he sat down and weaponized all his mature, maturity and therapy. It's like, your therapist now becoming your enemy. 
it's like he has listened to all of Drake's songs. Like even from the beginning, he was saying, "But I already know your angle. I don't need to calculate. You, but you're going to make up family stories because you listen to Mr. Moral, like type vibes." And he even tried that, saying, "Oh, well, you are victimized as a kid. That's why you're taking this victim out." But Mr. Moral wasn't about that. Apparently, it's about him not being abused. But his apparently his mom was. So when he said he wasn't. She didn't and believe his him. His mom thought he had been abused. Yeah, but he yeah. said he wasn't. Yeah. But this girl he wasn't even thinking deeply, bro. So he just brought it out. So like it, he didn't even have to respond because for him he had done his part. And even Drake's response kind of like added to what he was saying. Because Drake's Drake's excuses were kind of weird, bro. Okay. His 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 response to bro, you have a daughter is bro, we planted that information in your camp. Maybe you planted truth in his camp. Okay, fine. His information his reply to Bro, you you like li- young girls? Was bro, if I, I'm too famous, I'd be in prison if I was doing this. T- bro, how many famous guys are walking around? You know, funny thing is that line was interpreted in different ways. Bro, Rick Ross was killing people. me, man. Bro, bro, it's your writers. <laughs> the way you translated <laughs> it to your writers, they, that was it. <laughs> bro. So the people interpreted <laughs> that line as um. Now you know what proceed. I'll remember. I'll remember it properly. Bro, yeah. but first of all, I have to say, man, my favorite part of this whole beef, what, what, what has been giving me some levity to all of this situation is Rick Ross. Shout out Ricky Rose. He's funny, bro. Ricky Rose, I'm always on his story. <laughs> he is genuinely funny, bro. <laughs> 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 this guy. But anyway, he's always dissing Drake. But so, I feel like Kendrick for him has accomplished his goal. Kendrick was not here to win a rap battle. Kendrick just wanted to now separate all hip-hop fans from pop fans once and for all like separate hip hop fans because Drake had over been dabbling in the both you know and dominating because he's like pop and hip hop and whatnot so he's going to, to separate he even ended the whole thing by saying are you are you my friend are you with me step this way step that way step this way he was trying to like draw lines in the sun like what we do this side is hip hop and by that what you were saying earlier about like rap beef hip hop beefs being dead and like rap battles I don't think that stuff has died has just died in the mainstream which has done in the mainstream is because of guys like Drake. But like guys who like still go and like battle rap, they are still there, but no, you can check YouTube. Dead. You didn't say dead, but you said it has become more like soft, like it's like more like dissing and what like like tea. No, no, no. I, I don't even know what you mm, said, but what like you were saying was that like in the past it wasn't about like digging up that dirty shit about guys. But I was telling that like in battle rap. That's how it was. That's what guys been. do. Guys dig yeah. up that dirty mm. shit about each but other. But you're also saying like these days that like, it's not like that. Like guys are more like J. Cole, like come and whatnot. So I'm like, anyway, no, 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 no. Never I mind, was never the mind, one never saying mind. that's what people were saying. Never mind, never mind. Yeah. But, okay, I take that back. But the fact of the matter is this, man. That guy for me, in my mind, it, like for me, I used to think that all this was hip hop. Like all American music is hip hop. And by American, I mean North American. Even you can throw Drake and Weekend in there. <laughs> but this guy showed me, no, bro. There's like, there's the guys who love hip hop oh. from that like for they know the history of this jazz there is a culture and this guy has been trying to that's, that last verse was so beautiful of like that of not like us bro but the guy breaks it down about how this guy goes to Atlanta like a colonizer gets his lingo from you little baby the guy, hits the, the guy feature gave for that six club guys. <laughs> and six we, guys we all know bro. those six guys and how they help Drake bro <laughs> like he has like two he has two albums with one of them he has another album with another he has like, you know what I mean? So, this guy, I don't even know what Drake is going through. But I feel like what Kendrick wanted to do and what he accomplished so well for anyone who pays attention is he has shown Drake exactly how he sees him how I, and why he doesn't like him. And hopefully he's hoping that even you won't like him for these reasons. But I will say this to wrap it up. Me, I don't care. I don't. These are not my friends. It has kind of stained also Kendrick for me. Now Kendrick for me looks like a bitter guy, bro. Like he's there on his okay. After he has performed in Randa, biggest hit. <laughs> after I'm in Randa, I go home and I beef on Drake. I check on what Drake has done. I'm yeah. like, no, bro. But anyway, for me, also that the best part of all this was like, wait, like Kendrick is the goat of hip hop, mm-hmm. not of pop, of hip hop. Mm-hmm. And I've actually seen the goat perform live, bro. Okay, let me yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just wish I just wish she was performing yeah, that's oh, a flex. Oh, 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 yeah. Now that's step the way. Yeah. <laughs> so you're clear on what you think Kendrick's intentions were. Uh, to me. But you also now you truly believe that like Drake isn't hip hop. Yeah, I do. Crazy. I think um, I don't think he's hip hop in any way, bro. This is what I'll say. Um, okay, not in any way. Maybe he's hip hop inspired. He's a fan. He's a fan of hip hop. 
He's a fan, bro. First of all, I think I think um, Drake is a hip hop artist. That's my opinion, and I think it's because one, hip hop is allowed to evolve. It's allowed. Um, the days of hip hop in the '90s are very different from what it is now. Because now, if you're saying that uh, Kendrick has been rapping about all these hip hop artists for time, starting from his TDE cipher, do you remember it? And at that time, he was still abusing High guys. <laughs> he was still abusing guys. Like that's why for me, this is not shocking. Um, and now you're looking at a lot of. I mean, even if you go to the actual definition of hip hop, you're looking at guys like Lil Dark, all these guys. They're rappers, bro. They're rappers. It's because hip hop has evolved. What I'll say is. Um, <coughs> With Kendrick, his beef with Drake, first of all, may I get why. I get why it's there. And I also get why a lot of the guys don't like Drake. Yeah? And maybe that that that, that beef has fueled what Kendrick is saying. Because he's a hater, bro. He's not hiding it. A big hater, bro. He's, I don't like haters, hater. man. <laughs> hey, you, you, uh, bruh, let me tell hater. you. I didn't know he was a hater. What to this level, you thought he was an angel. I thought he was a reformed hater, like he was born nah, in a good bro. kid from the mad city. He was the only good kid. How many of city? his recent yeah, songs have had hate? He's madder than the rest that he left back. <laughs> no, no, after, he's after madder after than the them. Movie, <laughs> <laughs> I knew that that guy was in cover. Like I knew that the all like the wholesome and like that that like higher self music he was making was just him like battling, but was like his journal, bro. Because when he came on me, so yeah. I'd be like, yo, I've been cheating on my girl for the last 10 years. I've been overdoing this. this, this. Like, that this guy, guy is not an nation. angel, bro. He has, he has never been. been. Never been. He been if anything, in hip-hop, I don't think there's an angel. None of them. So, thinking that um, there'll be like a higher person. Now, Kendrick is just a guy who <laughs> has come from the ends and has reformed from that. A dark not skin guy from the ghetto who raps at the top of hip-hop. That's quintessential hip-hop. Yeah. Now Drake is like Elvis he re- Presley. He, he might have reformed from I all that. that. I can't believe that Kendrick Jazz has like sipped in my brain this it, much. Bro, it's so crazy because like <laughs> you've legit allowed. And I get why. I get that why this man Drake is not hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> that is, bro. That's so wild. To bro, me, bro. He can't. He, but I guess he that's can't be in the same way like Lil hip-hop. Baby and Kendrick is. If Kendrick Lil and Lil Baby are hip hop, eh? No, listen, I say little baby. baby. I say little baby. Yeah. Listen, 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 listen. Yeah. I say little baby because he was name dropped. And he was the, on the other side of Mambo Rap. But if that guy is still like, we can still say he's the, of the Mambo Rap side of hip hop. And he says Kendrick is the rapity rap side of hip hop. Drake is not in that spectrum. He's That's not. Drake? So crazy. Because Drake is the only one who gets to fly from genre to genre to genre to genre of rap. That's what this guy was saying. Uh, let me tell you the problem. Let me anyway. tell you the problem with None that. None of those jazz. guys switch up. Let me tell you the problem with that jazz. People always say that Drake gets to do it. Nigga, he's the only one that can, bro. The only one. He's the only one that does the it well. How many one. little baby songs has he been trying to do with Afrobeat? I guess, artists, I guess it's like... I guess it's like sucks on any beat. Bro. That's not an Atlanta-esque okay, beat, bro. That's the same logic that they used for, for what? For Elvis back in the day, man. He's the only one who can, no, who can no, go, okay, who can okay, cross no, no, over. Okay, he's Ghana true. rapper. Yeah? Is he a hip-hop artist? Yeah, he's a hip-hop artist. But he has done Afrobeat Ghana things. Ghana is nice on everything. Bro. He has but, done Afrobeat but, things. It's but, the but same like, logic. Okay, okay, but it's like Ghana is a hip-hop artist who comes onto an Afrobeat track. What yeah? is Drake? What is Drake? Drake is he what artist be... jumping on nah. what? Let me tell you. Nah. Is he a hip hop artist jumping Drake on Afrobeat? Drake has just long enough for him to do everything. No, bro. Drake is a singer. Drake does R&B. Drake, Drake does, does every R&B. genre nah. of hip hop. Drake disagree. does Afrobeat. Drake can, to come and does come can, and does a South African we house. We can agree to disagree Drake goes, on that one. Drake goes and does drill in UK. Like, come on. Who else? Who like? You see, this is a point. This is a point. This is a point that's, that Kendrick was trying to make. Mm. Yeah. Fine. You can do all of that. But that's not you're not hip hop, bro. At most, you're like uh, you you fake accents. That's uh, what you do at most. I disagree, I disagree bro. I disagree. I disagree bro. I feel like Drake. Let me tell you that, what Drake suffers from the most is his his like surface area to take hits is too big. But <laughs> that's the thing. Like you know when there's just too much to aim at. That's what he suffers from, bro. And he's, he was up against a guy like Kendrick, who literally. Comes out once every five years, and in order for you to attack that. And meanwhile, for the last like at least three of those times that he has come out, classic albums. Mm. Good Kid, classic album. To Pimper Butterfly, classic album. Damn, classic album. You can knock Mr. Moral if you want. Mm. Sexuality, like, 
it just makes okay, it no, really hard to shoot at a guy who is barely on social media. You barely see that guy talking about his farm or you don't know who that guy is. Fucking. You make so know. many excuses for this guy. I'm not making excuses. I'm just because, telling you because, why it was more because, difficult. Because he chose to enter the rap himself, man. No, no, no. That beef was going to happen regardless. I'm just telling you why. It's so much easier for Kendrick to throw these types of shots. First of all, these shots have already been thrown at Drake. Because is a hip-hop. They, like, hip-hop like, what, everything that was happening... Eh? Is no more in hip hop rap beefs, bro, and diss tracks. And it's, it's this guy who couldn't keep up, bro. Is but this I'll guy that couldn't keep let up? You, let me tell you something. When you play with these songs side by side, you see for us we've been in a moment. And in a moment, that's why I'm telling you that blogs play such a vital role in hip hop beef, bro. The narratives that get spun are insane. For us we've been in a moment. On my way, bro, me, I was listening to those songs in the order that they dropped. Mm. <laughs> it sounds very different, bro. Now let me tell you, bro. It sounds very now different. That ain't sound like that ain't sound as like world ending as as it sounded. Bro, let me let me tell you. Let me tell you. For me, I haven't been reading no blogs, bro. You know me. No blogs. I've been listening to these jams. In fact, after this, my last segment is we rank out of the whole beef. Yeah, we can. We can. You, you make your your top five songs of the whole beef. Okay. Both sides, top okay. five songs. May have mine. Combined. And I'll tell you, yeah, combined. I'll tell you, it's mostly Drake, bro. Spoiler alert. Like, those you songs just are just bangers. Mm. But, uh-huh. Anyway, yeah, but, uh, but like, for the your, analysis... Your point is Drake is not a hip-hop artist. Drake, Drake is, is, is not, man. The fact that he's that versatile, eh? and the fact that these guys just hyper-focus and try to perfect this one craft... You can't put them on the same level. Okay, oh, fair. Yeah, but like you can put it in numbers and sales. It's, bro. it's, it's fair because that to that guy is it's, insane it's, to it's, me. Bro. No, bro, I'm not talking about mainstream music. I'm oh, talking about now people that I don't even know that are lib qualities of the world, the GIDs, the world. the guys who are actually rap rapping, bro. Let me tell you, why I'll don't t- listen? I'll, I'll who you, you should be I'll tell I'll backing up, bro? I'm going to all of them. I'm going to rebuttal is better to what you're saying with this. In my opinion, again, Drake is not from the hip hop culture. But he's a hip hop artist through and through. Yeah. That's what, my opinion. Because no. you know, hip hop culture is what you were saying. Of I'm from the ends. This is a this literally is put culture vulture in his name, bro. They've bro. been doing that. But that's is he my not? Thing. Is he not a culture vulture? How can he be, bro? Why? Okay. See, I'll, I'll admit. Because his dad is from Philly. That, Drake has done the accent thing a lot. Yes, that's mm. every I accent, can, bro. I can agree. Not even just one accent. I can agree. All the regions of America. I can agree. It's cringe. But you see, Drake is not like. He's not one of these hip hop artists eh, where he jumped in and like everyone embraced him type shit. I feel like that guy really bro. had to grind and prove himself in this hip hop shit before also, guys swallowed. Yeah, but bro, who, who didn't, man? Like, okay, look, so look at guys. it. Look at it from a, a perspective of another rapper who is not grinding and having to prove themselves. Yeah, but to the extent that Drake did, bro. And if anything, Drake Drake only had to prove himself in the industry. Drake had the look. Think and the voice to already go mainstream. No, 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 mm, no, 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 no. I disagree heavily, bro. Completely wrong. Heavily. So what you think? You think you think Kendrick has a more mainstream look, Drake appeal, had, yes. look like visually, especially in hip hop. Drake hip-hop. had the least hip hop palette. No, no, no. In hip hop, yes, but I'm talking about like numbers, like where Drake dominates, like world, world music. I don't think anyone could have predicted Drake, bro. Right. No one could have predicted the biggest rapper slash artist in the world be Drake. being a light skinned. Jewish Impossible. man from Canada, bro. Do you know how I many? It was so is, unlikely. Is a stretch. That guy is so light. My dad is here. Is this kid is here. This kid is super white. Maybe in contact. This kid is super. But Drake is a black man. Drake is a black man. Nah, 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 nah. Drake is a black light skinned man. I feel like guy is more in the middle. Nah, he looks a bit Arab. Nah, 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 nah. I'd say, I'd say, like even the Rick Ross jazz has got into your brain. I'd say, I'd say, who's in the middle? Who's in the middle? Like. Six, six Jiko. Jiko and Drake are the same skin tone. I was going to say like Zari. But <laughs> <laughs> Zari. <laughs> Zari and Drake are the same. That's Zari and Papa. Drake might be darker. <laughs> and Zari is actually... Yo, just like, I'm dying. Uh, that's so funny. <laughs> that is so funny. Zari, Zari, bro. I'm dying, Drake bro. Zari has an accent. Her accent definitely is authentic. Yeah. <laughs> definitely you can't have water. For it, bro. That's so funny, bro. But anyway, me, I'll say this, man. I don't care what guys have to say about Drake. Like, I think that Drake is one of those guys. He's very, like, LeBron in what his path has been, bro. Like, he's just a dude that everyone loves to hate. Mm. No matter how well Drake had done in this beef, 
I think that guys were always going to lean in Kendrick's direction. Mm. I think that's kind of what happened to the Pusha T shit. Because even up to now, I love those Drake diss songs in the Pusha T beef. The only th- reason why Drake lost that beef is he did not drop after that last beef song, bro. Yeah. And let me tell you another yeah. thing yeah. to configure. But even if he had to configure is crazy. Another factor <laughs> to consider, rather. <laughs> as you're configuring. <laughs> Hip hop as the line that this man was drawing, Kendrick. And this way, like it it tells to my f- like a point that it tells to your point, like that thing of make sure you don't become a monster. I feel like when he said they are not like us, even me he put me on the other side of that line. That you're not on you're not like him. Yeah, like I'm not like him. And I ended up on Drake's side. Because I feel like that can also apply to all the Afrobeat artists that dress like American artists. Like yeah, that they not, not like, like us. us. Yeah. And um Yeah. Tough. It's, okay, it's tough. 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 <laughs> it's tough. <laughs> Listen, I me mean, I'm willing to admit that Kendrick songs are hard. But Kendrick is wrong. Okay. For me that's my thing. And like <laughs> you everything that you've said. It's and hard. the way that you've said it, it's hard. you're the hardest guy on this. Like, you're so fire, bro. But the shit that you're saying just isn't true. There's a song where he says, in one of his beef songs, that Drake has no classics, bro. Has no what? Cap. That's cap. That's cap. Has no what? He has no, cap. no classics. That's cap. That's cap. I can't hear what you're saying. He has no classics. No classics. Yeah. Drake has, Drake has, <laughs> I was hearing bro. glasses. I was like, huh? Can I, can, I, can, I, can, I, can I elaborate on that? It's like, when this guy drew us on the other side, eh? And now I'm saying that we're, we're, we're actually on Drake's side. Eh? It's like the people who agree that Kendrick has won are in America. Mm-mm. They're in America. No, I, those are the, that's why you see the people like the clubs playing like like they don't like they're not mm-hmm. like us. It's in America because America for them like K Dot is is a, a citizen. Mm. You know what I mean? He's <laughs> one of he's like, he's a, but is there as the people or as the rappers? You know what I mean? He has a uh, national yeah, yeah. ID. Yeah, he's yeah, one yeah. of us. <laughs> is there as the hip hop, like hip hop rappers, bro. or just the entire guy? No, in Kendrick, but he made US. Bro. America, <laughs> like America. United like yeah. States, bro. <laughs> like I'll tell you this: for me, Euphoria is a better song than like that sonically, but like that is just a more familiar sound to Americans. Like, it sounds like some West Coast song that came out in the 90s. But Are we like counting like that in the, in of the course, songs? Of course, of course, of course, of course. No, no, they're not like us. They're not like us. That one is like, they're not like us. They're not like us. We have to dissect. That's why we're here. We have to dissect this wow, jazz. This, bro, this is, this is too important. <laughs> so all, it's very risky because if we don't discuss something in particular, <laughs> we'll be back, <laughs> bro, tomorrow. Did you see that guy who said, um, no, it was actually a chick who tweeted that if guys had the same... Um, Desire for the U.S. elections, bro. The comments. <laughs> it's, <cooked out. laughs> it's not as important. Bow, 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 bow. Uh, president, man. I, so anyway, let's, rank. Rank. let's rank. Let's, let's rank. Let's rank them. Let's rank. I'll start with mine. Your yeah. ranking is so difficult for me, bro. But I'll I start with mine because I already have mine. Okay. Uh-huh. I put number one Euphoria. Mm. I'll start from the top going down. Okay. Mm. Euphoria number one. Interesting. That song just gets better every time I listen to it, man. The first time I listened to it, I was listening to what he said. So it sounded like a chill song. Chill. But now, bro, all I hear is that cheap beat, bro. Oh, that beat is <laughs> so cool. That beat is crazy. That beat is crazy. Second song I'd put, Push Ups. Same reason. Interesting. That beat Interesting. goes crazy. Interesting. 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 Cr- Interesting. That beat goes crazy. Like Push Ups. Push Ups is one beat, though. The whole, two beats. It's two. Yeah, there's no switch up. It's the follow up that had the switch up. Family is Matters. There's a switch up in Push-ups. I thought there was a switch up. Yeah, he says I was trying to keep it PG. That's how it turns. I was trying to keep it PG. Someone said we was trying to keep it PG so that his w- his wife could listen to it. <laughs> <laughs> but I need to read you my favorite comments from this beef after this. Remind me after I give you my top five. I'm uh, finished. Okay, so number three, of course, is they they not like us, man. That jam is special. Like that jam is special. Number four, family matters. Mm-hmm. Simply because that's a freaking bop. And then, because it's a top five, not top four list, I have to put Meet the Graham simply because of how memorable it is in my mind. Like, that thing is stuck. Like, how I remember how I felt listening to it and discussing it and wanting to remove my earphones. Like, I'll never forget that. Uh-huh. I hope no one ever makes a Meet the Mochivis on me. <laughs> <laughs> With this level of introspection, talking to my son, my daughter have been hiding, my mom. My, but someone might actually have to die, bro. Like, I swear, if someone mm. makes a seven-minute song on me, on me and my family, you have to go, bro. You have to go. It's not me. It's not me that's going. I wish I had prepared to make this list. Yeah, but it's, uh, a, it's a tough one. I wish I had prepared to make one. this list. Because my, in my brain, 
I know what my favorites were. I just don't know how to rank them in this beef. Let me get you some of my favorite comment screenshots. As you look for that, let me first say this. I've started to enjoy Euphoria. That's the baddest, bro. I've started to enjoy Euphoria. That beat goes fucking crazy in the whip, bro. He hadn't gone on you earlier. <laughs> no, he didn't like him sounding like vulnerable it. on the voice. No, 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 no. I didn't like how he sound. Like the, <laughs> the way that he was rapping. I didn't enjoy his flow. I didn't Im- but I think because of like hearing the other this song, first of all, Kendrick has he got a new voice in this thing. You know he has more voices. There's a new voice that he got in this thing. Bro. It's like a complaining <laughs> voice. Like, <laughs> the, do you know that? that, that, that <laughs> you know what I mean? That eh? end of it sounds that like end of that. like that's when he's going like <laughs> not like, just a, like that. Ah. Exactly. <laughs> that voice. That's a new voice. He didn't have that voice. He before. didn't, bro. That just so, sounded so new. <laughs> My favorites of the beef. My favorite of this beef have been not like us, obviously. Mm. Family matters, cause on, bro. Let me tell you, if Family Matters had had time to breathe, Ooh. guys, that song is so hard. Ooh. I agree. That what song a jump, is bro. What so. A jump. He did that beat switching thing. If Family Matters had dropped, <laughs> bro, that song is so crazy. <laughs> Yo, like I listen to that song, I'm like, oh my god, this song is. Anyway, oh, personally, not the like us. It's the one which came with a video, eh? Yeah, oh, yeah. Actually, not like us. Like that. Also, Family well matters. done on the video, man. I'll video tell you that. Well done on the video. Family matters. Um, I like Euphoria for sure. So you are two? No, no, I'm a three. Uh, not <coughs> like us. Family oh, okay, matters. Okay, okay, Euphoria. Okay. I actually really like Six Sixteen, bro. I like six sixteen and the heart. I think that those are my those are my top four, mm. and then I'll put like that as well. Like that, yeah. I like that is a cold in no particular jam, order, but like if ever I'm to play some shit back, it'll probably be those. And even like Euphoria is tricky because I told you he was saying too much about <coughs> drinking it for it. Any, I don't know, but bro, Euphoria is about to be number one on the Billboard. Bro. Yeah, bro. I think it's number one last time. It's number one right now. They said they said and, and and like that is number one on Apple Music Store where you pay for the music. Song, yeah. And you songs are usually ninety nine cents. That one is a dollar thirty. Yeah. A dollar fifty. One dollar yeah. thirty, one dollar fifty. Yeah, oh, I'll yeah. just say it's very surprising to me now to go on the opposite end that <laughs> Kendrick has made better songs out of the beef. Even a better club banger, bro. As in, he has made better okay, jams. Not, not like us is actually. Like if, it's, if you dip it, Kendrick has made more money. Of there's no beef. club banger Kendrick has ever made that's like that. Bro. Relax, humble. <laughs> humble is not that's a club banger like not like us, bro. That guy has been making shit like fucking. What was this bitch where you and I was walking? Now I want again. Okay, no, King Kunta. King Kunta. What about what about that one, 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 one from drink, uh, drink, to power up, headshot, drink. Let me tell you, none of that shit. Faded. None of that shit is as hard as Faded. these three songs that Not guys like put out us. on this beat. <laughs> I'll also say this. Yeah, I'll say the same for Kendrick. Kendrick Not hasn't made Kendrick. good music. No, Drake, Drake rather hasn't made music this good in a minute, bro. I disagree. You think all the dogs was this good? I think there's some jams on there, bro. I feel like it's a touchdowns interlude, bro. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I'm hearing him. I'm hearing him. I'm hearing him. And bro, this way, like, I'm so, like, this way, like, I guess, for me, like, I was not... I was able to agree with Kendrick so easily it's because I'm not the biggest hip hop listener. Okay, mm. No, no, no. I'm a, in yeah, like uh, yeah, Kendrick Drake. Oh, I, go, Fuck I, like I think the future is David and Whiskey. <laughs> 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 so I think I chipped my tooth on this thing while I was trying to. Right now, Kendrick, yeah. You had my tooth on this thing. I can feel, feel like, like a crack. <laughs> I feel something new, bro. Some <laughs> new NML. <laughs> the dentine. The dentine is not dead. <laughs> and I think there's a beat here, man. <laughs> I definitely chipped my tooth. <laughs> yeah. Damn, that's a. Oh yeah. Who had the balogo? I knew that I chipped like in high school. One thousand percent chip. Like just look at this thing. Look like I chipped my thing. Can you see? Yeah. You can see. It's like a small one. Damn. This is one. Yeah, camera. Hey, <laughs> gee. I like how all this is on camera, bro. Damn, this that's actually they never go, bro. Let me open. Let me first check my tooth. Now yours is cartoon compared to mine, bro. <laughs> no, I love my teeth, bro. No, you can't even see your shit on the first. First, first check. Zoom in, zoom. Go, go to the mirror. Go to the mirror. Zoom, 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 zoom. I've zoom. seen it. I can see it. It's yeah. cartoon. It's cheap, cheap, uh, yeah. Take a picture and then you zoom it. But ah. go to there with that. Unless you get bro, dentures. Chipped. No, is look it? at this is chipped. You're fucking Kendrick, bro. <laughs> <laughs> 
guy has taken too much. <laughs> anyway, anyway uh, let me see. My top five. Um, now, me, the reason that's why it's tough to rank in terms of, uh, you know, top five in an order is, is it the beef or the song? The song, the song. The song, yeah. Okay, not like us, number one. Um, family Matters, number two. Euphoria, three. 616, LA, four. Meet the Grahams, five. I only have wow. one Drake jam, crazy. How many did I have? I had I not like us, I had Euphoria. You had I had 616. Then I had... Like that, I had one drink jam. I also had one drink jam. Crazy. No, no, no. I had two. I had two drink jams. I had the heart. The heart. Eh? I had the heart. You didn't mention it. Didn't I? Okay, now you have. Now you have. But can I have we, one drink oh, jam. Can we do? Can we do like verses, like song for song? Can we add? Can we add first person shooter? Yeah, because if you're adding like that, you have be, to add first person. Then they'll shooter. be even. Yeah. Yeah. Can we just song for song? Magic. Mm? Song for song. So it's first person shooter verse like yeah, that. Like that first person shooter. Mm-mm. That doesn't make sense. Why? Because that's why it's too all biased. began. That's why biased <laughs> <now>. <laughs> There's no equalizer. It's, it's the, song for song. It's not song for song because, for example, this guy dropped. Um, like that was in response to first push person ups, shooter. Then this guy dropped Euphoria 616. Then this guy dropped Family Matters. Then this guy dropped. Meet the Grahams and like that. But then even. this guy drops so one song and then they haven't changed. So we're judging one for two. No, no, but the the number, one, one, number two, two. of songs is the same. Mm. I think it's better. You judge. You, you get a more clear perspective of where you lie personally when you rank out of five, which are your best songs and why. Mm. Don't have to be like because it's sonically pleasing, but maybe I liked what you were saying. You get a better count of one, one. One one, but one, me, one one. Now you say, no, but the thing is, we can say which one is a better song. Yeah, if we rank them. Because that's like what you told me to say. Because if we are ranking this as meet the grams, for me is number one. Yeah. <laughs> number no, saying, one. out of all the songs in this escapade, how do you how do you how do you rank the songs? Which is the which are the hardest songs to you in terms of like? I can't song. believe I've not even put. That's single. not clear. I can't believe I've not put. <laughs> what do you call it? Yeah. Taylor made because Taylor made. You see, it? Taylor made. Oh good. Taylor made is cool. I'm Taylor removing. I'm removing. So I'm removing. Fire. Meet the grams. I'm removing. No, 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 no. Family matters. Actually, fuck push ups. Can't, can't be fu- push ups has to boom. Fuck push ups. Push ups has to boom. Taylor but made. Let's see them do a promo. Taylor made. Mm. Taylor made. Yo, was so like. Yo, West Coast savior. When you listen to Taylor made in the order that the songs dropped, oh my god, bro. Because Euphoria came after Taylor made. After telling a guy where we need you, where you. And the guy does that. <laughs> That's where the problem is. You know what I mean? <laughs> it sounds so bad on wax, but at the same time, mm. Euphoria ends with this guy saying, Don't say nigga no more. Mm. And family matters starts with niggas. It sounds so cold, bro. Yo, like, so cool. if you guys are trying to rank them, what's the criteria you're following? Is it like the one which is sonically pleasing? Or yeah, the for me, it's like I really bad. like that song. I don't like. Yeah, I don't like. I really like, like that song. Cause I like that song. I want the words, bro. Mm. Oh, for you, uh, why you like it is different. different but exactly. which ones do you like? Not to me, I rank it according to your jazz. No, let me rank according to your jazz. Rank according to your jazz. Meet the grams. Number one, crazy. Number one, Euphoria. Number two, Family Matters. Number three, number four, six sixteen. Number five, not like us. Hey guys, let's do some questions. Are those all Kendrick songs? No, no, no. Family Family Matters. Matters. Let's do some questions. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, let's. Oh, let's. Let's do some. Let's wrap up. Let's wrap up like this. Thank you, Kendrick, and And thank you, Drake. Drake. For arguably the most exciting two weeks in hip hop for the last like fucking twenty <laughs> years. Bro. Did you see? Did you see that co- like comment of uh, this? We are so invested in this beef. I've not seen any porn on that year. Some porn chick replies is like, "Man, we are also invested." <laughs> That's the reply to that. Was she so, so invested? The hose is off. <laughs> <laughs> With the hose, someone turned off the hose. <laughs> but okay, yeah. as we're wrapping it, I'm you. Who is your god? Jesus Christo. That's my greatest of all time. Yeah. You know, I'm going to say Kendrick Lamar. 
God. I'm my good. <laughs> Michael Jordan. Even music guys. <laughs> you need to be good. <laughs> See, like, <laughs> now the difference between, I, I know I keep using the Messi and Ronaldo analogy, but, like, the difference between this one is we haven't been able to pick the definitive winner. Guys are actually still really, really split. On who yeah. won? It's very split. It's very Guys split. Guys are still really split. But I'll say when it's all said and done, I think that the guy will be like, it's not even, I don't even know how to say it. Kendrick cooked. That's all you yeah, have I'll to say. Kendrick, 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 Kendrick cooked. Kendrick cooked who? But I know Kendrick after this pod, they are going to be <laughs> finished. Kendrick, Kendrick cooked who? Cooking yeah. us. Kendrick no cooked who? No, no, they can't finish the sentence. Kendrick cooked who? He didn't cook him. Then what did he do? He smoked him. He marinated. He marinated. He marinated. He marinated, bro. Check, check, he checked him. What did he check? The decision went to the judges. <laughs> Bro. No, it's supposed it to be wasn't it unanimous. That, it's supposed to be that a part, one that hard part. Was it hard five, hard five, hard part six or hard part five? Yeah, that hard part six. At the end of the song, the guy did not sound confident. He was like, yo, this was a good exercise. You guys were saying he tired. Humble, 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 humble. <laughs> you know, bring out the pen, you know. Is it the pen? <laughs> <laughs> bring out the pen, you know. <laughs> but the jam was hard. The jam was hard. No, the jam was hard. The the but the guy was giving energy of I've given up. I don't want to diss you no more. This thing is now due to blessing because of what and this and that and you know that. What's interesting? Another thing I think that played into this beef. I don't think Drake hates Kendrick. <laughs> 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 yeah, like, have you ever like, got into a fight with that guy? That guy hates you. <laughs> 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 For you, you're a day. For you, like, man. I don't feel that guy, man. <laughs> but you don't feel him because of the energy he gives you, bro. Mm. But for him, he hates you, bro. He <laughs> wants you dead. But I feel like he just reinforces the fact that Drake is a fucking troll, bro. Troll, eh? Yeah, this yeah, guy ain't like, he's, he don't hate that guy, the guy. He's just enjoying. Bro, how many pieces did you right get from that song? We, had, we have certified lover boy, certified PDF file downloader. We have <laughs> Jesus Christ. OVHO. We have yeah, mob. OVO, the other virginal options. <laughs> we have. Um, Malibu's most wanted. I didn't like that one. I love that one. I didn't like. Bro, you, you had to Google that thing. I didn't like other. You know, I think it was hard, bro. That was because after that he said, "Pussy." <laughs> 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 I did like hear that. that no, that. This, no, that's what it went over your head, bro. Like that this one's Kenny no. says go over your head, no, no. matter what he say. Drake said that. Yo, let's do some questions, man. Let's do some mob stock you and a real quick, bro. Yo, if you're not. Subscribe to our Patreon, subscribe. If you're not following us, follow us, subscribe to our YouTube. Uh, yeah, man. I'm going to blast through this. You guys think you'd get juicy questions and confessions from a non-anonymous <laughs> Q&A? Hell no. Hell no. Uh-uh. Hell nah, no. no way, bro. We tried. Didn't we try? No, no, we didn't try. We didn't try, but, try, but, but like... Maybe we'll try. You guys would not keep it 100 yeah. unless you're an anonymous. One of my bosses at the office is looking kind of ripe and saucy. Should I try to cane or if she jams and now she is awkward and I try to make it worse? I haven't caned. You already know what you have to say. Do not, bro. Do not. I face tune. Reach your higher self, bro. Meditate. Go to church. Pray. You're better than that, bro. I believe in you, man. Bro, is this a boy or a girl? Yeah, why are you cooking a person? Stop trying to touch your boss. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lose-lose. <laughs> it's a lose-lose. <laughs> if, if she says no, you lose your job. And you lose your dignity. Wait, the boss is looking Maybe. ripe. Man, so is he so looking ripe? Listen to this one. I first tune all my IG pics. It's a boy or a girl. It ain't much, but like, okay. If it's a girl, it's, if it's a boy, it's kind of funny. <laughs> Do you guys know how crazy chicks are going with that face tune, guys? Now crazy chicks are going. You didn't hear this thing. Some guy was oh, saying Oh, face that. tune. Just, let's say, just don't look, don't look behind nah. the curtain, man. I'm dead. Do nah. you guys, did you hear nah. this guy? This guy, like, Oba, he was dating this chick from, like, online, online dating, and then this chick was using filters. And when they met for a date, this guy was like, nah, you don't look like the way you were looking. Let's that's that that's, a, com- that's a, mo- a much more common story than you think. Okay, next one. Where do you guys stare at a girl for longer than five seconds and decide not to walk up to her? Because... Why would I, as a girl, go up to you after this happens? It feels embarrassing because it's giving you decided against talking to me. Is it? Say that again. Can you read that again? Read that again, please. Why do guys stare at a girl for longer than five seconds <laughs> and decide that not to? Five work? seconds. <laughs> <laughs> five seconds. For longer than <laughs> five seconds. Four and a half. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> six. 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 Ah. Guy looked at you for six seconds. I like it really and really he didn't come. <laughs> five seconds. Five seconds. You guys know how long five seconds. But maybe you had a pimple in the middle of your head, man. Uh-huh. Yeah. No, anyway. maybe you're just lost in thought. You know, you're lost in thought and you're just. Yeah. You're just and you're just looking above her head, slightly above her head. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know. I can't even help you. 
what is your take on dating apps? Do you or would you use them? <coughs> so someone was trying to convince me to use Tinder. Yeah, use Tinder and what? Bumble. Bumble, yeah. That shit works, man. Tell me about the dates they went on while they were here, what? Okay. Yeah, guy, babe. Check. Not me, though. I can't speak for babes. Not me. Check. Have you guys, but you guys haven't used them before. Have you used, have you used one, but not Maybe, not in, maybe not in boredom like, to like so swipe. Like last I've decade, that. man. <laughs> yeah, not and in that the was 2020. During I even told that story. Yeah, yeah not in the 2020. And I didn't have a... It wasn't... I didn't... <laughs> that babe is leading here straight, bro. I'll tell you this. It's... Girls have a better experience on these apps, dating apps, than guys, simply because the majority of the users are guys. So guys are usually mostly They're rejected by the few babes, and mm. chicks are usually accepted by the majority. Like, you know what I mean? Would you yeah, guys be down to use it, or is it too much promo for the app? No, bro. I wouldn't Figure be down to use it. You're not I have enough I'm game, bro. I'm a, not available. I have yeah, enough not game. Available for but even if I did, bro, I have enough game, bro. Yeah, but as in you have to get on a date to speed the game. Yeah, I can get dates. Do you think you're going to pay Tinder five dollars a year? Oh, man, use that free one. No, but that, that free one, one is limited. Swipes yeah, but like you get like five swipes, but it's okay. Yeah, why are you why are you being swiping? Well, you're so bad. You're getting <laughs> swiped back. Eh? You're that no, bad. No, no, no. I'm a <laughs> the Every five swipes, I'm getting swiped yeah. back. <laughs> how can you know if you've never used it? Hmm. Well. Oh. Just yeah. Bro, but my, my boy who my boy who da- who uses it, it once told me that Oba, when you get chicks, they are always like Oba, how much do you have? So it's more like you know, guys are selling transactional. Yes, yeah. it's not that this normal dating like you know, let's meet here and then it's just like you don't have yeah, no, to have, have any financial date, exchange. Like or something like that. No, it's easier for normal babes to get a normal date than it is for a normal guy to get a normal date on that app. Fair. This one says, yeah, I'm that guy who gaslit his girl to three, Sam. Thank you for letting the world... Oh, God damn. You're that welcome. bad manners, bro. I've been thinking <laughs> about that question more and more. <laughs> who gaslit that his manners, girl? Well, thank you for letting the world know. I, I think it's... That guy is not girl. Even, girl and they're both <laughs> dying. No, even, this, even the comment, bro. Just see that this guy is a dark guy, bro. He's a dark... Kendrick. I like that jazz, Kendrick. Man. Not even Kendrick. Bro. He's a Drake. Let's but get together boy. soon, please. <laughs> yeah? No. I didn't even Let's get together this. soon. Please. Let's get together soon, please. My response is no. A question, bro. Let's like, get together. Ask. Soon. No. And I imagine like a Not person happening. said that and they were like giggling after they sent it. Never. <laughs> like they had done something. Never. <laughs> Read my lips. Bro. We. But do you feel like never, sometimes some ever, guys may ever. send questions <laughs> when they're like, <laughs> like, are supposed to go to a particular person? <laughs> I think people send these questions because they're like, they don't believe that we don't actually know who sent it. They don't believe in the anonymous thing. They think that we can read who sent it. Oh. So they be shy. Bro, we know nothing. Like, yeah, we nothing. actually can't see who sent the messages. Let me see. So do you guys think you'll have a <coughs> you'll have Uncle Mo as a guest? I think you would I think we've had Uncle Mo as a guest. No, we had him on the old pod as a guest. Mm. Had him on. Someone uh, that guy DM'd me actually. <coughs> DM me uh, saying he has Uncle Mo's number, we should hit him up. But we'll have Uncle Mo on one day, bro, but like Uncle can't yeah. force that thing. Not a message, but first give us an opinion from each of you where to get a good tat in Kampala. I'm looking to get one when I get back. A good what? Tat. Tat. Linus tat. Uh, Linus actually should come on the pod, bro, soon. Yes, jazz. Eh? Fire jazz, bro. Nah, bring him on. Really cool dude, too. Come on, he plugs his business. Yeah. If you ever need anything, you can count on me. Thank Thanks. You. But you need to tell us who you are, man. Yeah. Yeah, because it's anonymous, bro. We literally <laughs> cannot see. You <laughs> guys are the worst at this thing. Because you just don't trust We can it. count on you, but guys, who, really bro? Think it's anonymous. We yeah. can see who sent it. Bambi, can you set me up with a friend, please? No, I have no friends either. And I'm not crying about mm, it like you. I think it's because you said <laughs> Crying emoji, crying emoji. I think it's because you said Crystal was your buddy. Yeah, even your buddy who wants a, a good friend. Eh? Hit me up, hit me up, actually. Hit me up. You know, man. Nah, this guy is just. <laughs> oh. <laughs> some, let me see something. This guy was like, yeah. was the pod out yet? Hit me up. <laughs> when is it? Yeah, yeah. These are from. These are from. Oh, today. from today. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. This one says, I agree with Magic on the compliments thing. I don't know how Stroke want to receive them, but if I think that I like compliments me, huh? Then I'm on cloud nine. Those are the only compliments I believe to be true. Nigga, did I type this? Because <laughs> I agree with you 100%. That's exactly what you would do. Yeah, this is what I'd, like, I'd answer. Like, I'm not good at compliments, but if I think, if it's from someone I like, bramelated, mm. like, 
elated for lack of a better word. Let's like see. Air cleaner 200. Okay, we're not going to do your It's an ad. Your ad. <laughs> <laughs> But for, I'll read it though. Air cleaner 200k engine oil caster oil caster oil air filters 400k oil, ta- oil filter 200 brake oh, pad points. Oh, this is we, we once talked about this. Hey, it's, a replay. it's a replay. It's a replay. As it, you should save this way. Front, break, front, front. <laughs> they got you, bro. Actually, <laughs> I mean, how would you reach, reach out to Melvin. How you, you, you know yourself. Be a Melvin. Ah, bro, I just remember something just I had to tell you guys. Uh. One of my boys sent me a review on TikTok of a Subaru Impreza. Mm. So a review. A review, yeah. So okay. obviously, like, it's so your particular model. A Ugandan, Ugandan guy, yeah. My, mm. my model, 2014. <coughs> so. Obviously it's one of those things where like it's a very short clip. The guy says watch our YouTube channel for the full review. So I went to the guy's YouTube channel. And the guy had, like at the beginning of both of his videos he always starts with if you want to impress her with an impress by her an impress. Okay. And bro, the more that I watch his game, the more I realize that like Subaru impresses apparently are for babes, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Especially this model, this particular model, the fourth generation. <laughs> It seems That's that blow, yeah? <laughs> the Subaru Impreza <laughs> is a chick whip. Why? I don't understand it, bro. <laughs> Nothing about that whip to me said, and <laughs> but like I'm, I'm trying I'm to see it now. First of all, ever since then, now every time I'm driving, bro, I'm looking at the other Subaru Impreza drivers, babes, babes. <laughs> <laughs> is it that because like they have more bro. is that more like reticular activation system where for if I say like look for yellow yeah, yeah you see is, yellow no, 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 no. I'll say this I'll say this first of all I'll say in Uganda there's very few gender specific whips other than I'd say I mean I know them a vits for <laughs> babes and, and a land cruiser for guys wrong IST for babes mm. Aria Aria for babes Aria for babes okay, Aria for babes because it's impressive there's also like a Aria apparently bro and it's like the new Aria because for it the consumption is kawa And they say that the guy literally said in that video that the women think it looks cute because it looks angry. Angry? Yeah. <laughs> that because the lights are like, the lights are, because the lights are like this, the women think it looks cute. Bro. No, <laughs> I thought it's just for ladies because I don't think that it has more room for, for modification. No, no, they think it looks angry. No modification because they really the want to modify What mod the chicks going to do to our women? What modification are chicks going to? Anti, that's why it's for chicks. No, that car Because, has mods, you know, bro. No, you, of course, you, I don't, I don't think that you can, you can, can mod modify it anymore. You can mod any soup. But, yeah, man, that thing makes feelings. Mixed feelings. <laughs> This, This guy's like, guy about to tell that guy, man. Yeah. Give me a Prado, bro. I still love my whip, bro, but like... Suzuki <laughs> Junior. <laughs> guy's about to buy a, like a Fuso. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. Let me ask, do you guys think rainmakers are real? Yeah. A thousand yeah. percent, bro. 1000%. Oh, rainmakers like the traditional ones. Yeah, 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 yeah. they are. Um okay, which ones were you thinking are real? Let's like start business, bro. Like <laughs> make a dream. Who, like just um cloud seeding. No, I think eh? I cloud, that's what I'm thinking of. <laughs> cloud seeding yeah. is real rainmaking. I don't know. I I Some feel like of all like going on, of bro. all spiritual beliefs that's the one I've seen the most evidence. <laughs> <laughs> like, But just living the most I, 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 what's it called? Um, when, when you have bipolar weather, go here, bro. It's either wet and that's a, or dry. That's what I'm saying. That's <laughs> the most evidence for it because I've seen guys go from sun to rain. I've seen, I've seen weeks where it rained every day, except that day when I was aware <laughs> that a rainmaker had been employed, bro. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. And that's also, so where dink. it also didn't, it just didn't rain in Agua where we were. You guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> Would you guys consider yourself uh, Loki superstitious? Lo- Loki is the correct way to put it. Very Loki. Would you? Yeah. Um, Very Loki though. A couple of uh, weeks ago, I noticed, you know this itching hands and like your upper eye is twitching a bit. Someone's yeah. talking about you. Do you believe you. that thing? Not even talking about you. It's like about you're expecting Kamani. Hmm? Like when you, like your eye is twi- twitching and then your fingers are like, they are itching. Expecting yeah. money. Expecting money. You guys are twisting like ah. 10 years, bro. It has actually yeah. happened to me like... My eyes be twitching, bro. I'm always I expecting. Nah, nah, yeah. nah. <laughs> 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 I'll be scratching the whole pod, bro. I'll be red-eyed, bro. <laughs> uh, uh, Someone says, please, let's hang out soon. No. How do you guys post videos on your Patreon? Please help. How do we post on our Patreon? 
we use links you yeah. post on to post youtube then you just uh make the video unlisted and then post the link to the patreon yeah. upload to youtube link to patreon last question is it me or are these guys of drake and kiddo taking things way too personal this thing has gone way beyond this track. that's what i'm saying we've earlier. given you one hour bro one hour. Yeah. Oh, but wait did i say i disagreed with that though because of plugin you did disagree I say with? i disagreed with that Chaja. I, I, did say, I, first I disagree. disagree with that. I don't think that they've taken it too personal. Yeah, I me, think they've me. taken it like. Me, I think Kendrick took it too personal. Enough. Only Kendrick took it too personal. No, I think they took it. Uh, they took it far enough. They took it far enough. Now uh, all we know is Drake, Drake Kendrick rather is a. Not a nice guy. He's like Israel, rabbit dog. You attack him, you're getting a nuclear Drake, weapon. Yes. You and your your daughters, yeah. bro. Each oh. one, 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 one. Kendrick has never claimed to be a nice guy. Yeah, he has always that's been. the difference. Like and give me grace. Mean, that's why I made Mr. Morale. Yeah, I, I think we've not had a rap battle in such a long time that Kendrick doing this seems like he's the only one. Guys are like, eh, how is this happening, bro? Guys, yeah, I think we'll have another soon. Yo, uh, I, w- I want to ask you something. Oh, yeah. Yesterday, I was listening to some interview of this guy who led to the, you know to uh, the arrest of these guys who are killing women in Entebbe. Why well, you remember that stuff? Do you oh? remember? No. Some, oh, yeah, some yeah I remember that's a long time ago. Like yeah, I remember when the chicks were getting killed. Yeah, yeah. so this guy was uh, talking about like, he was abducted, and then these guys were calling. They made him call people to send money because they wanted money. It got me thinking, so I was like, have you guys ever thought of like coming up with a code word with your friends or the people in your circle? Like, for example, if, like, Maji calls you and is like... The orange is ripe. Not necessarily. Like just be in contact. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, in case... being kidnapped. <laughs> we just start talking about ripe oranges <laughs> <laughs> in the middle of a call about your <laughs> abduction. <laughs> 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 because <laughs> even these guys were, like, yeah, putting them on a phone a call when they are Don't on shout. gunpoint. <laughs> they hang up. <laughs> do, 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 like do, do. Point, yeah? <laughs> yeah. So I was thinking, what if you'll be like, tell Magic, if I ever call you and I'm like, Send me 800k. Just know I'm in danger. A no, okay, amount. it can't be money. It can't be money. What if I actually need 800k? It has to be, it has so be, it has be like, character. it has to be like, yo, my kid is napping. Don't wake him up. No, but that's so if, that if I don't have a kid. That's if they're telling you, like, act like we're not here or some shit. Act like everything is normal. Hey. But if you're making a call, mm. okay, I guess, yeah, I guess. Yeah, I guess that's I guess, like that. I'd be like, yo, Melvin, what up, man? Yes. Is the kid sleeping? Is my kid sleeping? Is my kid napping? If they're asking me to, I think it has kid. to be a question to the other person because you can't say my kid is napping that they're yeah. no, no, no. listening to you. No, like that, what, like what you saying? Like, yo, hello, Melvin. I was on this phone, but like, uh, I just wanted to first call you and find out, man, how is my kid? Has he slept? Has he taken a nap? Mm. Don't pick up. Mm. Don't, don't make know. noise for yeah. him, man. Yeah. Yeah. But like, can you? I'm in a bit of a hustle. Can you send me like a uh, hundred thousand US dollars? Oh, I'll pay you okay. back. Then this guy, no, 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 no. But when no, that no. like, this kid, he has no kid. When that like, sound fishy a bit. No, it will sound fishy to him. I don't yeah. sound fishy to anyone who I know. I don't have a kid. I think it has to be something that the guy knows that you don't have. Like for example, if 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 you call me and say, mm. man. My child is like this, this. Or you ask me how is my child? Hey, how is my kid, man? I'll be like, huh? But al- but also huh? by the time the guys <laughs> abduct you, I think I know they probably know something about you. You can't no, just tell this. Just has a kid, though. I mean, if like, they abduct talking you, about having kid, they abduct you and they go through your phone and they can't get money from you, bro. They're killing you, man. It's not even like personal. No. Anyway, they just they just they, they literally survive. abduct like a whole bus of guys. And then they they go phone by phone looking for car. It's not it's nothing personal, bro. You're just on that bus. Just bad luck. Sorry, just man. bad luck, man. So have you ever like had that uh, like as a thought? Yeah, I like the kiddo angle though. Like come up with like a like keyword. Yeah. I feel like just ask a question that is very clearly not true. <coughs> so they can so you can raise some red flags in their brain. But you also like, have to something is off here, man. You as the person you have to be smart, bro. Because yeah. the guy can be on, on like the other end up. of the phone, eh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ask you, man, how is a child? Which child? Which child? Yeah. <laughs> Are you cow? Ah. Ah. You don't wake him up, man. Don't Yo, wake up your boy has ended. I tell you, can you help me with 100k USD? I'm going to pay you back, but just let's help me with it, man. To, it would need to be something so clever, bro. I says I'm just like, bro, track me. So I mean, that's that's that, get a bullet. That's that, why I was that, always thinking, like, you come up with a sum of money, and you be like, I can ask for 600 or anything, but if I ever say 800, just know I'm in danger. Mm. But you can say 810. 
Yeah, maybe when you can, you need, if, if, I add, <laughs> if I add like a 10 on the number. <laughs> maybe you can say, you can say like, oh, nine, uh, nine, give nine. me 900, but never saying 800 exactly. But the issue is what if now the guys are asking for f- 10 million, but your limit was at 900k. Auntie, that's where you're like, hey, you don't have the this. limit. How about 800? Just mm. you, know what you understand? Mm. No, that's mm. what. You get? You know what I would do? I would tell, I would tell these guys, yo, I have... 30M or 100M at my house, like say under the bed or some shit. Mm. Help me go there and get it. Obviously, if they didn't get to my crib, they'll find guys there and be like, bro, this guy told no, me. They would this. never go to your crib. No, 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 not the thieves. The guy I've called. Mm. I'll tell them, yo, I have some money somewhere. Let me just call my boy who I trust to go pick it and meet us with it. Those guys are so smart. They can be like, is there anyone at home? They can't allow you, bro. Tell them to leave. Mm, we then are going. We go to yeah, like together. these guys have been through all that all before. That you you just have to, to make sure that the victim. person that you're calling is getting the message without you. No, then worried. I'll tell them. I'll tell them I know who to call for money. Mm. When I call you, I tell you, Yo, I need you to help me get this money from home and come and meet me here with it. Yeah, but also check on my child, man, and <laughs> make sure they're okay. Well, it is the child thing. <laughs> something like it has to be something check absurd. Yeah, check on my check on my dog. Please make sure that my plant is watered. But also, you have to first talk about it with your guy because your guy can do what this guy says. You know, may think, may think if you're clever enough, eh, you will say something that will not make sense. Like, Windek, you'll tell me, like, man, just make sure that you go home and check on my dog. Now, Windek, I don't know where you live. Okay, no, Louisa. But oh. I'll be like, Windek, has a, like, huh? you guys just put that. Like, there'll be something <laughs> like, there'll be something <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, why oh, is Windek wait, asking me to check me on his dog? To huh? go to his house that I've huh? never been to. Yeah. To add Something. Like, uh, mm-hmm. uh. I'll call you back. You're telling me again, check on me. Please, please, check on my dog. Check on my dog. To be fair. It's yeah. not coward. Yeah. Check on my dog. Something like, I'll be like, nah, 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 nah. Make me like evaluate all of our calls. Like before I start telling the truth on the call, I'll give it some, some room. You first see, do you see what the guy is saying? <laughs> I'll first agree with whatever I guy. Yeah, hey, man, yeah, yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> then after five minutes, you call back. If I get picked up, you're like, Ooh. man, what did you mean by uh, <laughs> your house plants are drying? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, help me go and water my shit. I'm in Zanzibar. <laughs> the guy replies, yeah, you're like, okay, okay, okay. okay. Let's just wrap this up. That's Yo, funny. Listen, very fun pod. Hopefully, it's the last one that we have to do about this. But I have a feeling that it will be. I have a feeling it is. Yeah, yeah. both over it. I, I think unless Kendrick dis- uh, that Drake decides to antagonize again. Okay, first of all, I think Drake is going to rap about this for the next five years. That's the thing. So, yeah. Yeah. Trust. That's we Trust. Bro, Trust. Then he can expect the Drake remainder of the 10 jams, like bro. On every album that Drake has ever dropped, there's still at least one song or at least a couple of bars aimed at Pusha T. Now, me, let me tell you, I don't think Drake can do that again with Kendrick because he knows that if Kendrick catches a whiff that I'm the one they're dissing Kendrick has the remaining how many do I have in stock one plus one plus two plus five plus five plus five you know Drake a proud arrogant man (laughs) the one who was who who gave up on had part six we had how he gives up no 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 no. that's now that was like this was a good exercise in a year year when he releases when he releases when did he say pen like that pen you know you know Kendrick um made all his songs copyright free yeah, yeah, yeah. So we can actually play them on the podcast as we are talking about them. Uh, yeah. Like especially like, I'm uh, not like us. Actually, I looked through the, dif- the description of Drake's tunes and then, yeah, it was like, over label, universal, blah, blah. Uh, written blah, by, over who, who, who. Kendrick's, Kendrick's things are Kendrick's just written, free, written by Kendrick Lama, performed by Kendrick Lama. But Drake, written by one, one, two, three, four, five, performed yeah, by Drake. Yeah, but Drake ah. also has, uh, Drake's deal is completely different from Kendrick's. Fair, yes, but yeah. writing credits is not attached to your deal. Drake shoot has other writing credits. Yeah. All the districts. Drake has no song when it's just him. That's on DSPs right now. None. Oh, anyway. Until next time, my people. Thanks yes. for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Know, maybe you guys will see you next week. Too. Africa must what? Peace. Unite. Must unite. This by Drake and Kendrick trying yeah. to dis- <laughs> break us apart, <laughs> bro. We hip-hop. must unite. Hip hop. Hip hop must unite. Uh, it no. Africa. <laughs> Africa, Afro beats, rise up. Also, <laughs> Mr. Mady and Flavor, bro. We hope you guys are kawa, man. Nada, nada. Africa <laughs> must unite, whether they are kawa or not. <laughs> I love you all. Peace.